Tiffany Adu, and I'm in my second year as a graduate assistant with Tulane University women's basketball team. I'm originally from Slidell, Louisiana, and I graduated from Tulane in 2011. My primary duties, I'm actually a graduate assistant who focuses on film coordinating, and then I do marketing promotions. I work with the marketing team in Wilson Center. My process as becoming a graduate assistant here at Tulane, to me, it seemed like a, a spur of the moment situation. Coach Stockton actually called me into her office, and this was when I had no idea what I was doing. It was after season, so it didn't really register that I was graduating, I needed to get a job, or you know, if I wanted to go to school. <laughs> um, so she asked me if I wanted to be a graduate assistant. I was like, yes, no hesitation, because I know, I think it was after our last game, I was just really depressed. <laughs> I was like, I really want to stay at Tulane, and she gave me the opportunity to stay. So I'm still here, and I'm enjoying it, I love it. My most memorable moment, moment, of course, was when we won the conference championship in regular season. As for being a graduate assistant, I definitely have to say just the experience of being at Tulane and getting to meet freshmen and not being a player. So it's a different relationship that I build with these players. Um, so I really enjoy that. And also the game LSU when Danielle Blagg and the team just, just amazing. That was the best game ever. Um, conference tournament was amazing so I'm looking forward to this season. Time as a player has helped me here at Tulane in terms of being closer in age and just having you know a common bond with the players here. Um, I believe that they are able to open up to me just because they know that I've had that experience as a player in school and just you know the complexities of being a student athlete so I definitely think that they're able to look at me as not really a staff member I think they look at me as someone that they can relate to and sort of, you know, confide in when they're having difficult times as a player. Uh, playing for Coach Stockton, I definitely think that relationship as a player, when I came in as a freshman, I was really nervous <laughs> meeting her as a coach, but I think she's been an amazing coach. I definitely think that she allows her players to have a, you know, a balance between being a student athlete and having a social life. And I definitely enjoy that, and I always tell everyone that whenever they come into Tulane, that I just think this is the perfect place in terms of being able to have a social life and have and play basketball and just enjoy both of them at the same time. Um, in terms of working with her, I definitely enjoy the fact that I'm able to build a different relationship um, as a player. I sort of build that player-coach bond, and you know how you can create trust and. All of that within, you know, playing for your coach and just doing whatever you can to make the team better and, you know, being a captain on the team and always having to talk to coach and just, you know, be, be what I'm doing now in terms of being a player liaison and talking to the players and, you know, speaking with her about it. It's, it's kind of the same relationship. Um, so in terms of this season and last season, I definitely think that we've definitely grown in terms of off, off the court have seen another side of her, which is not different from, you know, her being a coach. And I definitely enjoy that. I think she's amazing. She's an amazing coach. She's an amazing person. So I would love to stay here. <laughs> I would say what I do away from basketball in terms of not being on the court or dealing with film coordinating or marketing promotions and something that I have a passion for, I would say this year I also have the opportunity to work with the Final Four Committee. Sue Bauer gave me this opportunity. And basically what I'll be doing is doing a lot of outreach uh, programs. And so I'm also doing that for the Tulane women's basketball team where we've created a Riptide reading program that has been given out to Jefferson Parish and Orleans Parish schools. And so the participating schools will basically come to our games. Well, they'll read a book and for each book they'll get a voucher to come to our games and then we'll have a huge celebration at one of our games, December 19th to be exact where the schools will come and we'll introduce them and honor them for what they've done and their accomplishments. So basically I have a passion for doing outreach programs and just reaching out to children in the community and I definitely love New Orleans so this is a perfect opportunity to do this. I would say the best thing about being in New Orleans is definitely cult the culture. I love the fact that I can go down the street and hear a live band play or I can go down the street and you know see a sports team play. I just think there's just a combination of so many different things going on here and I definitely think that Tulane is you know in the heart of the city and I think you're able to go so many places. You have the streetcar, you have so many events coming like the Final Four this year <laughs> and you have the Super Bowl and you know you have Mardi Gras. It's just, so many people want to come to this city and just experience what we have on a daily basis. So I definitely think that you should take advantage of having the opportunity to go out every day and experience these things that people pay, you know, tons of money to come and see for a short amount of time.